welcome back to my channel my name is selena for those of you that are new for those of you that are returning what's up what's good what's popping before we get started don't forget to like comment subscribe turn your post notifications on because you guys know i come with a video every single day why would y'all miss it okay friends i got a towel on don't be thinking i'm naked <laughs> anyways it's like 9 45 oop, oop, don't hit the wall y'all see my collarbones popping <laughs> Anyways, it's not 45. I'm about to grab a protein shake. Um, I'm working, but we got a lot of like training to do today. Like as far as like me having to get training done. Like, ugh, yeah, wish me luck. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab the shake. I did work out this morning. Um, I did arms and I did some cardio so yeah 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 perfect our fair life protein shake me in there like somewhere i'm about to get that and then um what am i about to do i'm about to get that why can't i get my sh other shake up and then get a straw and then go to work i guess yeah uh, yeah 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 um, but yeah, friends, so, oh, wait, my straw. Hey, Magic, what's up? Magic's crazy. <laughs> mm. I'm gonna wash my hair later on today, too. Um, but yeah, so, I'm gonna go ahead and drink my protein shake, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Let's have a great morning. Hey, friends. Okay, so it's 11.15. Um, I had to put my robe on because I'm freezing. I get so cold you guys like freezing cold every time just every day just living my life but i don't really want to put the heater on my heating blanket is okay like for me to have but the actual heater no because let's see what the weather is supposed to be like today i really think yeah it's it's supposed to be 80 degrees today 78 which is crazy which is why i do not want to put the heater on because i know i'm going to be hot eventually um so whatever i don't feel like eating eggs <laughs> i don't egg whites so i am just making uh um what am i making chicken sausage lemon it's supposed to be 78 degrees today you want to go outside yeah that's what i thought anyways i'm making the chicken sausage in the air fryer just warming it up you guys know it's pretty much already so I'm just warming this up and then I'll probably eat that I honestly really don't feel like eating anything you guys know sometimes I get like this um, my period's supposed to start in like a week or so so I'm trying to see if I can like eat anything else other than egg whites I could eat I don't even feel like eating the cabbage I'll probably just eat that one little chicken sausage for right now um, I did drink my protein shake. Um, that took me a while to drink for some reason. That was weird. Um, but whatever. We're good. I'm still working and trying to finish up this training and stuff. So we'll see. But yeah, friends. I'm having a pretty good day other than that. Oh, wait. Let's remember to open our windows to the walls. Okay. I feel like... I be having to open windows all the time and the fact that the sun is out and it's 78 let there be light <laughs> I'm funny but yeah so anyways friends I'm about to go get the chicken sausage just to be done in here in a little bit and then get back to work um I'll show you guys my little chicken sausage the same chicken sausage I eat all the time so I'll see you guys in a little bit Alrighty friends, so this is what my chicken sausage is looking like. It's the chorizo chicken sausage that I always eat. But this time I have a side of mustard. I tell you guys, y'all know, if you know, I don't really like mustard like all too much, which is crazy. It's crazy because actually mustard, like I used to love, 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 love mustard um, when I was like a kid. But now I don't really like it that much. Um, but anyways, I'm going to like try it with this sausage. It should be good. We'll see. Um, and yeah, I'm about to eat. It's 12.22 right now, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey, friends. Okay, so I made a sandwich. 
you guys know normally I don't eat bread like that um, but it literally just has like turkey it has like this lettuce slaw stuff that I made with literally just lettuce um, what else does it have on it lettuce oh, I got some mayo on me lettuce mayo and red wine vinegar let me show you all. so this is what it's looking like it does have tomatoes on it as well I will not be able to eat all of this but yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and eat and it's 323 I'll see you guys in a little bit hey friends okay so I have a little bit of my sandwich left it looked like it was like a lot but it was only because it had like a lot of that um like lettuce on top that lettuce lettuce mixture really wasn't a lot um but it's still crazy how much I can eat when I'm like about to start my period like nobody I think that's why you guys know in like my weigh-in video I did um a little bit ago I was telling you guys about like it is very like it's getting a little difficult it's definitely a mind thing um when it comes to eating and losing these last like few pounds because i have like when i'm on my period or when i'm about to start my period so for like two weeks my eating is just all over the place and then for another two weeks i'm good but those two like it's 50 50 which is why you guys are seeing me like lose weight gain weight stay the same lose weight you know what i'm trying to say so um because like i said before my period i normally can eat so much more food during my period not so much um <sighs> sorry y'all i was like staring into space but i'm really looking at this anyways um but yeah so it is like 4 15 right now so i do have a little bit of my sandwich left i'm working still i'll probably like eat on that or whatever um and then drink some water. I am drinking some water. But now while I'm eating this sandwich, if I drink water while I was eating this, I would be sick, to be honest. Because bread is, like, heavier for me. So, um, and I just eat regular bread. I, You guys know I did try, like, a lower-carb option for bread-wise. But it's just, like, really not worth it. <laughs> because to me, the bread, like, the lower-carb option for bread, it was just, it wasn't good. So, comment down below if you know a lower-carb option for bread you guys know i'm not afraid of carbs i'll eat carbs um i feel like um in this journey anyways to stay away from diet culture you do need to eat carbs like you're gonna have to eat everything carbs fats proteins all of that so um i do definitely still eat regular degular bread um but yeah so my friends are like messaging me on my computer and my phone so i'm like what's going on but I'm about to get to work. Um, I think later tonight we're going to make the chicken and potatoes like we were supposed to make yesterday. I think we were supposed to make that yesterday, but we'll make chicken and potatoes. Um, I think I'm going to do like curry chicken and potatoes like you know I like to do. So, yeah, friends, I will see you guys in a little bit. Hey, friends. Okay, so I made my food. Okay, so we're having salmon. Oh, oh my gosh, I almost dropped this. First of all, I look crazy. Okay, but anyways, that's beyond the point. Um, we have salmon and then we have our cabbage. This was like the little meal prep that I did. The last little bit of cabbage. So this is what it is looking like. Cabbage with some turkey um, in it. And then we have our salmon. So I'm going to go ahead and eat this, guys. It is about almost 6 o'clock. I think it's like... 45 or something like that so i'm gonna go ahead and eat and then finish up my work and then i think we're gonna run to the hair store because i know i ran to the hair store the other day but i forgot something trying to be cute i forgot something okay so we're gonna have to run to the hair store and then i want to wash my hair tonight at least and then i'll do the little quick week tomorrow so people is outside and grilling it is 80 degrees today you guys despite me looking cold but yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and eat. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey, friends. Okay, so you already know where I'm at. I'm at Target. You might not have known that. But I am at Target. I did go to the beauty supply store because I needed to get, like, a dome cap for my hair. And don't mind it. Still haven't, like, washed it and blow-dried it. But even when I blow-dry it, it's going to probably look just like this because I don't like to put too much heat on it. But um, I'm just at Target just because I feel like I need to go to Target. Um... 
I might, I don't know what I'm going to get, to be honest. Um, I never have any real plans when I go into Target. Yeah. That's how Target gets you, though, I promise you. So, low-key, though, I kind of want to find, like, a new, like, hairbrush. I know it sounds crazy. I was just at the beauty supply store. But I feel like sometimes the beauty supply store be overcharging. So, I just went in and out for my dome cap. I think Target might have dome caps, too, but I didn't want to chance it, so... Yeah, friends, I'm about to go in here and then I'm about to go home. Right now it is 7.48, so I'm trying to get home at least by like 8.10. Um, so I'm only going to be here for like 20 minutes or so. So let's go ahead and head into Target. Um, I'll let you guys know what I get. Okay, friends, so I am back home. It is like 8.15, so I did good. Let me show you guys what I got from the store. I literally got like two things. Um... I'm talking about from Target. From the hair store, you guys know I just got the dome caps. Um, so I did pick up this brush. It's a detangle brush. It says Pro, yeah, okay, Wet to Dry, Wet and Dry Detangler, The Not Doctor by Kanye. Um, I feel like I needed a better brush, like, in the shower when I'm detangling my hair because my hair is already kind of, like, I don't want to say it's thinning out, but it's very, um... How can I say this? Very, uh, I don't know the word. What word am I trying to look for, friends? Like, it's very, um, uh, fragile. <laughs> there we go. It's a little fragile. So, I did pick up this brush, um, because I feel like it's going to help me. Like, I have brushes and things like that, but I feel like this is going to be the best for detangling my hair. So, yeah, we're going to try this in the shower today. I think it'll be cool. And then I did get two more bras, you guys. I got a bunch of bras, but I did get two more because I wanted this size. So, right now, I'm wearing, a, I believe this is a 36D that I'm wearing. So, I like wearing C's and D's. So, I can fit C's and I can fit D's. Um, I'm trying to show you guys because my bra kind of ain't right. So, the reason why I like D's is because you guys know, like, my my breast is kind of saggy because I lost so much weight. So, I feel like D's cover, like, everything. Like, it even gets, like, my side boobs and everything like that. So, that's why I like wearing D's. I do have a couple bras that are just, just like this that are C's. And actually, I probably could have got a 30, I can wear a 34D, a 34C, um, but they didn't have any. Like, 34s always go quickly, so I do with a 36, and I normally just put it on, like, the very last hook. Um, but yeah, so this, this is a 36D. I just get these, I get these for, like, more of the coverage, um, like, all around type of thing, because C's... They don't, I feel like they don't get like my side boobage, if that makes sense. So, this is what we had to deal with. That's what I found out that, like, found that was like a lot better for me is to get a, a slightly bigger bra. But, like I said, if I can find a C, like, if I would have seen a C, a 36C, a 34C, I would have got it, but they didn't have it. So, yeah, friends. I'm about to wash my hair. I don't know if we're going to eat today. <laughs> what are you going to eat? But I don't know if we're going to eat any more today. And I say that because um, I get extremely full. Like, I get super, super full um, off of just, like, just because of, I feel like, what I ate today. I did eat quite a bit. And, but in reality, did I eat that much? You know what I'm trying to say? Like, people be looking like, Selena, you ain't eating nothing. But I feel, like, super, like, full. Like, I feel satisfied, like... I don't really want to eat anymore type of thing. But I know I probably should. At least we might make the food. We might try to like make it. Just so I don't have to tomorrow. And we can just have that tomorrow maybe. I don't know. We'll have to see. Because um, I probably should like prep something. Um, I was thinking about doing the chicken and potato curry. Or for sure doing chicken and potatoes. But I don't know, like, what exactly we're doing as far as, like, if we're just doing chicken and potatoes, like, roasted or if we're doing curry. So, let me wash my hair, though, so I can get that out the way. I'm going to try to, hopefully, this brush 
if you know, if you got a good brush and you detangle your hair, you're, you're good. Like, everything will be great for you. If you got a really shitty brush, it's not going to work. You're going to have some issues. So, we'll see. But I'm going to go ahead and wash my hair real fast, blow dry it, so I can get ready for tomorrow as far as, um, like, getting my hair done. Like, doing my hair. So, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Probably when I'm done doing my hair, washing my hair. I'll probably still look the same because I'm, like I said, I'm not going to blow dry it that much. Well, that well, because I don't want to put too much heat on it. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey, friends. Hey, so it's like 930. My hair is finally washed. I'm still annoyed because my face is like kind of breaking out, but I have really bad like hormonal acne. Not really bad, but like I'm starting, like my body is always changing after VSG, like literally. Um, yeah. Because, like, I feel like I started off having really bad skin, like, the first few months of VSG. Because I feel like everything was just coming out. My hormones were going crazy. And then my skin, like, evened out. It was, like, perfect. X, Y, and Z. Um, I feel like this has to do with, like, my periods being weird, too. But um, now, like, I get, um, like, hormonal breakouts. So, like, right before my period or right after my period, my face will break out annoying um but it like i said it's oh it's actually 10 it's, it's 9 55 i thought i i can't see um so i'm really not cooking today because like i'm not gonna make the chicken and potatoes right now because it's so late um so i do just have two chicken wings these are like actual like wing drumsticks you guys know i don't i don't really like drumsticks i did put some hot sauce on it and have some ranch on the side so we'll see if i actually eat these um, but I'm not cooking anymore. I'll probably drink some water if I realize I don't like this. Um, because I don't really like drums. I only like wings. And these are kind of big. So it already is like turning me off from it. I don't know why it keeps on like not getting focused. But yeah, friends. So I am going to call it a night. Comment down below if you guys like flats or drums. Let me know. What's your favorite? Okay. Hi, I'm doing my hair as I'm working. So... You gotta do what you gotta do. Only because I don't want to be up so late tonight um, doing my hair. So I was like, let me see if I can get a start on it at least now. Because I told you guys when I was doing the quick weave before. Oh, I'm doing a quick weave with straight hair. That's what I'm saying. When I was doing that before, um, it took me like three hours. So yeah, I'm about to just go ahead and do this. It's late, you guys. It's like one o'clock and I'm just now drinking my protein shake. So... I've been kind of distracted because I've literally been trying to do my hair. So I'm going to go ahead and do this and get this together. Um, and yeah, I'll keep you guys posted. But right now we're having our protein shake. Hey friends, so all jokes aside, I'm not doing the best with my eating. It is 3.45. All I've had was a protein shake today. But you guys see, I've been doing my hair. So this is what I'm saying. It's a quick weave, bust down middle part. But this is my natural hair. I still got like a little bit to do on the top. If you guys see, this is my outline. I did not record this one. Um, I did not record this one. I only recorded the curly one. But in reality, I should have recorded this one because I bodied it. And I did like something a little bit different um, with this one as far as like what I, my base, like the underneath. So this is going to be super, super cute. Normally, I do not like my hair like just bone straight. Um, but I think this is going to be cute, you guys. So I probably, and it did not take me three hours. That's crazy. Because the curly one took me like three and a half hours. This one, I literally finished in like, this one I literally finished in like, well, I'm not done yet. But if, I, I did all of this in an hour because I did this on my lunch break. And I literally have, like, probably a couple more tracks. I'm looking in this mirror because I'm probably sit here and, like, start gluing down some of the tracks. But I literally do not have, like, much left. Like, it's actually crazy. So, yeah. If I eat, I'll let you guys know. But it be days like this, like, I don't get hungry at all. Like, literally. So, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey, friends. Ah, so, my hair is done. Um, I didn't like straighten my leave out like uh, it keeps going down. I didn't straighten my leave out like too too much right now because I'm not going anywhere and I don't want to put too much heat on my hair. But 
Isn't it cute? I need to eat. It's like 5.15. I have not eaten, so I'm about to make a sandwich. So, yeah, give me a second. Okay, friends. So, I made a quick little sandwich. Literally, it just has like lettuce, and white American cheese, three slices, <laughs> three slices of turkey, and then like just some bread and some mayo and some mustard. So I'm gonna eat this. I need to catch up on some food. I really should have cooked the potatoes and chicken last night. But yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and eat. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey friends, okay, so this was definitely a failed what I eat in a day because it's the next day. <laughs> I tell you guys, I get very like, if I'm super busy, I sometimes do forget to eat. I'm gonna open this window. I'll be forgetting to eat. Um, and sometimes I know some people get hungry. I get hungry too as well sometimes. Um, but to an extent, like, yes, I was getting hungry, but my brain was just like focused on other things, if that makes sense. So that kind of made me not eat. Um, you guys know I had that sandwich and I just had... My protein shake that's it i drank some water but not like a lot of water yesterday was just bad i'm not gonna lie um so we're gonna try again today i did go to the store and i did get some food um it's friday what is the date oh, oh my gosh friday um february 24th so i did go ahead and get some food um because I feel like that might have been the issue as well. I didn't have like a lot of quick food to warm up and stuff like that. Which I still don't have a lot of quick food to warm up. But I feel like we'll be okay. I And then I'd be forgetting like what I actually have in my freezer and my fridge. Because you guys know I could have made that chicken yesterday. Um, you guys know I got like the chicken little frozen chicken already cooked cutlets. <laughs> I don't know what they're called but it's already cooked i just had to like warm it up or put it in the air fryer or something i could have made that i could have made there's a lot of things i could have made but i didn't so today is going to be a better day but you guys know i'm very transparent with you guys not every day is going to be a great day but make it better than the last okay like seriously so i am aware we're about to start off by drinking a bottle of water so i'm about to grab that um drink a bottle of water you guys know i like to start my days off with drinking water i'm working right now so i'm about to just go ahead and do my thing and then yeah i will keep you guys updated we this is my hair still i did flat iron it again today so i need to get my ends trimmed as you guys can see like it's a lot of split ends um but that's okay and then on top of that like i'm just putting this on there i know i'm probably gonna have to like do something else with it later but it's gonna be fine for now i'm working in the house i'm not going anywhere y'all only seeing me so y'all my friends i come on here looking crazy as you guys could see that yesterday i was looking wild but i bodied this quick weave and did okay so yeah friends so i'm about to get to work drink my water i'll catch up with y'all in a little bit okay friends so it is 10 o'clock i'm about to drink my protein shake bear life bear life is life okay fair life is life so this is literally you guys the only protein shake i like um people a lot of people drink the premier protein shake i don't personally like that i did start drinking those first but i do not like it so yeah um and i feel like um Premier has a lot more options. Look at my hair. Y'all, it is gonna frizz up. I'm gonna try to get, I think I got a wax stick. Hopefully that will work. But I don't wanna do like too much to it right now because I'm working. But anyways, so I believe uh, Premier Protein has a lot more flavors, but to me, Fair Life tastes like, like it has the best quality. So yeah, to me. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and drink this. I'll see you guys in a little bit. It's 10 o'clock. Friends, okay, so it is 318. Oh wait, hold on. What is this? Okay. Anyways, it's 318, you guys. Um I am I made some what is this? Mashed potatoes and salmon. I don't know why I love mashed potatoes and salmon. I just had some salmon um in the uh what you call it in the fridge. 
<laughs> I'm cracking up. Um, I just had some salmon in the fridge and then I had this potato that like literally needed to be eaten. So I just mashed it up. I did use some heavy whipping cream, some salt, pepper, call it a day. Um, but yeah, so it's 3.20. I'm going to go ahead and eat. And then I don't know what today's going to bring us. It's early, but it's like late. Like I'm almost done with work. I only have a couple hours left of work and honestly i don't have a lot of work to do um this is probably one of the calmest days in a while i did take a nap on my little breaky break so i took like a literally it was probably like 15 minute um little nap so but yeah friends i'm gonna go ahead and eat i'll see y'all in a little bit i'll let y'all know if i can eat all this too because it's not a lot but we'll see hey friends what's up Okay, so it is now 7.30. Um, I'm actually going to meet one of my friends. I'm meeting my friend somewhere. So that's where I'm going right now. I probably won't take you guys with me just because it's um, confidential. No, I was kidding. No, but seriously, I probably won't take you all with me. Um, I was able to eat all of that salmon and mashed potatoes. Um, I just been like today's been like super like breezy as far as the day goes, but it's just been like I still been moving if that makes sense. Like it's been definitely like a chill day. Um, but and not as hectic. Like I can feel like everything calming down now, which I'm happy about because it was getting crazy, you guys. Like literally i had to if i had to stop going to the gym and stuff like that like this happened kind of last year as well but i was in the like earlier stages of my journey um and i actually stalled out quite a bit when i was um last year around this time because i couldn't go to the gym consistently because of my job like that's like the bad thing about like working i know like I, you guys know i always talk about like work-life balance work-life balance and like you're gonna have to want it as far as like working out and getting healthy and like making that sacrifice wow sorry y'all making that sacrifice and stuff like that as far as um like you're gonna have to work out like you're going to have to so um I feel like that's like a learning thing. Like when I coach and stuff like that, I always tell like my clients, like you're going to want to like, you're you're gonna have to like make a decision like and do what, like set a routine, which is why I'm big on like planning because you are gonna need a routine, um, especially when you're busy like this. People in Atlanta can't drive. Especially when you're busy like this, you're gonna want a routine. You're gonna wanna set something in place so you can like be successful. Like me personally, you guys know, I love working out every day. I know the benefits of working out every day, X, Y, and Z. But is it like feasible for me to work out every day right now? Like how my schedule is work-wise? No, it's not. So what I try to do is I do try to make like healthier choices, healthier decisions when it comes to my food and what's going into my body because I know that I'm not going to be able to work out as hard and as often as I want to. Um, because I am technically at like a good goal weight or within about 5 to 10 pounds of my goal weight, and because of that, I am okay with like maintaining like and being on like a heavier part of my... Um, of the scale as far as like my goal weight goes. So I don't wanna go over 170 and I do wanna get to 150 if that makes sense. But I'm giving myself grace. Like the goal right now for me is to just make sure I get enough rest and make sure that I'm able to like rest and if I'm not like if I'm tired, I can't get in a good workout. So there's like no point of me, which is why I did like one of the reasons I did stop with my trainer because it's just like I'm wait, wasting or paying all of this money to work out and go to my trainer and I'm not even able to give 100% because I'm so exhausted. So my whole thing is, is when I work out, I'll be wanting to give 100%. 
if I'm not able to give a hundred percent, like there's no, like it's not gonna work out for me. So that's like how I go about things, you guys. Sorry, it's getting dark because I'm about to get on the highway, but. I just wanted to tell you guys that because some days you I might not work out and it's simply because I feel like I can't give 100% or I won't give 100% because I'm so tired. So yeah, friends, but I'm about to head over to my friends. My phone, my camera is dying actually. So hope you guys enjoy this little vloggy vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Turn your post notifications back because you guys know I come with a video every single day. Why would you want to miss it? Until next time, bye friends.